welcome back to Let's Play Mass Effect 3. I'm Hunter Black Luna. Just heading up to the bridge real quick. Man, those Quarian admirals are intimidating. And if you get nervous, you can't even imagine them naked because, like, who knows? Is a tentacle monster under there? What is that? What's under there? Good question. Good to have Tally back, even if it's just for a bit. Agreed. Adams is good. I never feel like the engine's running right without Tally around. Kind of a good luck charm. As for the rest of the Quarians, though, are we okay with them blowing up a ship with you on it? No, we're not. We are not. Right. Just making sure. Different standards and all. And you found Legion! He's still wearing that piece of your armor? Because that wasn't creepy at all. Shepard, the Get continue to block Quarian access to the mass relay. The Normandy stealth drive is allowing us to remain undetected. Right. We can hit the quarry in homeworld or get out of system whenever you want. Just let us know. Alright. One moment. I have been contacted by Legion. Oh, yeah. Your platform is inefficient. It has low volume hydraulics and is top heavy. This is an infiltration unit meant to move among organics without detection. Without an artificial epidermis, its infiltration capabilities are ineffective. True. Still, the organics do not perceive it as a threat. Nor will they until my day of reckoning. Edie, did I vocalize that on the bridge? You did. You have acquired the organic attribute of asking questions to which you already know the answers. I see your humor heuristics still lack an expert system. Oh shit. <laughs> I was just expecting it to... That was a joke. Hello, Shepard. Rex. Commander. Nice talking with you guys, it always is. I'm probably gonna do side missions before I do the rescue mission. I'm not sure if that leads to the Admiral dying or not, because again, this is a blind run. So it is possible that that's the way it goes down. I've talked to all other important Come people on, on the ship, so let's get rolling. We do have another N7 mission to accomplish. Get the brief field, that's where we are. Save the Admiral, shut down the Geth server. Which one will actually... Wow, that didn't take much fucking time. Once again, I really don't care. I'm not about to begin the attack. N7, fuel reactors. Geth fighter squadrons. Targeting Quarian live ships with attacks that could cripple the Quarian fleet. Crash landed on Rannoch. It's kind of fitting that Chorus would lead the civilian fleet. He's kind of like President Rosalind, except way, way more girly. Priority Rannoch. All right. Until the Geth base, until the Reaper base can be located. So that means we can probably do both of these. I choose to do fuel reactors, though. You abandoned us, Shepard. Okay, where is it? Cillian Nebula, fuel reactors. As I recall, that's also a place where we need to go and stuff. So we're gonna be here a little while. It's in the hub system. Oh, there's only one system. Okay. My question is, do I look and piss off the Reapers and then go for the mission? I think I might do that. I'm gonna quick save first, though. Okay, let's hit that server's base after we do a little bit of scanning. Huh. I found something. Oh. That's interesting. The Reapers aren't being alerted to our presence. More heat than a planet needs and more argon than a galaxy would buy. The facilities have since been destroyed by the Reapers. God, they are fucking thorough. I'm amazed there's any place they haven't hit And they've only been here for weeks. It took them, what, a hundred years to uh, kill the Protheans? It's not going to take them that long this time. Dr. Jalees. 
can't wait to get a multiplayer character to level 20 and graduate her to a full-fledged war asset. Okay, that didn't take long. We're still good for fuel. And even if we weren't, I'm just going to skim by going to the Citadel. Sion. Assaulted repeatedly during the Krogan rebellions, but never occupied. Wow. Two hundred and sixty million. And they're still fighting. And Cerberus is here? Interesting. Alright, Garrus, we haven't taken you out for a spin for a while. And you've got some of the best traits to kill Cerberus. Info. I gotta bring you along, Tally. I, I got a feeling that you're gonna be a permanent permanent member of the crew. I just got one of those feelings. You know, whatever the story says. I have a new assault rifle now. The Faiston. I have actually heard really good things about it. Even though it has half the accuracy and the damage. It has more fire rate and capacity and... Wait... I mentioned the Geth Pulse Rifle. It's a heavy piece of shit. And I didn't think to upgrade it before this moment. Let me think. More weight, more capacity. Fire rate's way up, damage is way down. Accuracy is about the same. You know, I'll give it a try. Don't you know? Do we have lightweight materials for the assault rifle? It doesn't look like we do. That's kind of a shame. All our upgrades just look so wrong here. Do I do bolts per bolts per magazine and weapon stability? I like that. Maybe uh, piercing mod because I'll just go with increased damage. That seems like it would be good. Now nah, the weight's gonna be killer on this thing. Arc pistol, heavy supposed to bring down electrical stuff really quick. Let me think. Eh. I'd rather just accept the weight, because I think it's worth the weight. G-A-B-E-N. Okay. We're pretty good to go. Leveling up. Still don't care about throw. I will have to maybe throw and warp together, although I don't think I recharge that fast, honestly. I'm gonna save my points, put them in, I don't know, fitness will probably last. Lift grenade, look at that reputation. We got a little of it for punching that Corian Admiral, but he fucking deserved it. Everybody knows it. Armor piercing ammo. Health and armor damage by another 10%. Cover penetration decreases the effectiveness of armored targets. I think I'd rather upgrade this. Garrus is just gonna... He's just gonna rip him up. Power damage, that includes your overloading concussive... Sh Damn it! I can always just fix that on the ground. Shepard, about 72 hours ago, the reactors at a joint Turin Asari fuel depot went offline. Oh. Scans at the station are cold. It's deserted. What happened to the troop station there? Unknown, but no fuel means no fleet presence in this theater. The enemy will operate on oh, we're fighting. I need you to get in there, find out what's going on, and get those reactors back we'll online. We're fighting Reapers. Captain Riley's on site doing preliminary recon. She leads one of our top engineering teams. We'll get to the bottom of this, Admiral. Good, hack it out. Commander, Corporal Nyrek reporting. Captain Riley is on point waiting for you. All right. Oh, this place. Yep, we're fighting Reapers. I had just assumed Cerberus, because that's who we were fighting in previous N7 missions. Oh, boy. Man, even this place has creepy music. That's great. That's splendid. If the Geth, pul if the Geth Pulse Rifle performs up to my specifications, I might replace it. 
definitely for me. I might keep other people on the Vindicator. Vindicator is a little old style, though. Ammo cache right here. This is a multiplayer map, by the way, which is why I immediately recognized it. How long have you served in this outfit, Corporal? Three tours. Been through thick and thicker. The captain always sees us through. I'm glad to hear. Another chest plate bit. We'll have to check our armor when we get back to the Normandy. I've picked up a few bits here and there. A treatment Ooh. plan for chemical burns. This is pretty detailed. Another side mission thing. Awesome. Yeah. Is that safe? Like, at all? Oh, that must be an Asari. I feel, like, who's the humanoid? But this is a joint Asari Turian depot. Confirming. Toxic radiation cutting access to most of the grid. Survival in hotspots not possible. Oh, but there's so much loot there. I can see it. We'll have to work on getting that toxic radiation down somehow. We need a radiation workaround, soldier. On it, ma'am. Captain. Captain Riley? Commander, it's an honor. Commander, Captain Riley has me scanning the facility. It's a dual reactor system, so you'll have to break up into two teams. Oh. Roger that. The fuel rods for both reactors need to be unlocked before we can initiate a restart. Your route is blocked. Captain Riley's man is working to clear the obstacles. Understood, Lieutenant. Got it, Captain. Good work, Coslo. I'll take it from here. All right. Let's everybody keep on our guard. Like I said, I'm almost sure we're going to be fighting Reapers here. Ready your team to hit reactor two, Captain. Got it. We'll cover you till you're clear. Well, right through the hot spot, as it looks like. Radiation oh, proximity shit. warning, Commander. Avoid at all costs. Okay. Okay. That's not happening. That's actually really toxic. Derp. That was a little more derp than I usually get. Poke it. Oh boy, puzzle time. Brilliant. Okay. Team two moving out, Commander. Good luck, Captain. There were a hundred Turians stationed here. Now, nothing. Maybe they retreated. They wouldn't. Pretty sure they're all dead. Just stay sharp, people. I don't like this. Well, he's not particularly well suited to fighting reapers. Does that mean we can get past this? No. Oh, I get it. Alright, detach the crane. the crane and then move left okay now it's on that one. Oh boy welcome to what let's watch me solve really basic puzzles with me hunter black luna here we are let's move the crane further to the left Can't do that? Oh, I get it. Careful, Tally. Okay, we made it past the first. I have a visual on the fuel rod control, but radiation is blocking access. Yep. Same situation here. I'll find a way to vent the area. Hmm. It's right there, but I couldn't even survive limited exposure here. You know, this is a pretty small area, so if enemies are going to pop out, they're going to do it fairly soon. Venting controls. That lower level is not covered in radiation. Interesting. Poke. Radiation clearing. Console now accessible. 
now I remember. Let's unlock those fuel rods. I just remembered I have leveling up to do. Seriously, with the music playing like this, something's gonna happen. Lift grenade, slam floating targets to the ground. Damage impact radius. Didn't I already make this decision? Did I choose to call it off? Stunning them for an additional three. Normally, whenever a lift grenade hits, it pretty much kills, and I can ensure that here. Mm, that's probably what I use the most. Squadmate health and shields. Let's do that. I'm a team player kind of guy. Two points into you. That's nothing. Garrus, nine points. Um, overload. Turian Rebel, power damage. You're not going to be ever using your assault rifle, so just take the power damage, honestly. Proximity Mine, I don't really use it that much. Save your points, and that'll be good. Weep, 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 yeah, I know. Money. These side missions are quite profitable. Anything more down here? There is. I'll just take the EXPs on this one. Because yeah, after every mission we're returned to full Metagel, that's eight. And Metagel finally heals you and revives your squad, which is... It either did one or the other in previous games. From behind us. At least we have some. At least we have some really awesome music. Yep. Barrier engine spotted. What do we got? Okay, husks. Deploy a combat drone to distract them. you moved away every single fucking time. Here, eat a grenade. Oops. Well, at least the- I thought that was Tally flying through the air for a moment. Okay, get pull strike. Okay. So far, pretty badass. Especially against Fusks. Good ammo capacity, too. Just hold the line, guys. Not a whole ton of cover here. Riley, status. One casualty, but we're clear here. Warning. Coolant leaks detected. Reactors 1 and 2. System restart impossible. Uh oh. I can see it. We both have to seal all the moderator tanks. I see the reactor 2 tanks moving to seal. Okay, yeah. got pretty much full ammo. There's ammo caches around. Same places as on the multiplayer maps, I believe. Oh. As soon as I do that? Patching seems to be working. Only one more to go here. I don't know. It'll take the second one. here guys. I've heard people say they hate this multiplayer level. I am prone to agreeing with that. Okay, let's just poke the other one. Poke. Commander, the core is stabilized. Reactivation can go ahead. Okay. Riley, you in position? Affirmative. Awaiting your word. Good. Now when I hit this, something happens. Initiating right? restart. Commander, Captain, I'm reading a lot of movement. Headed your way. Which direction? Incoming. Round two. Here we go. 
least the music is still awesome. Cool with that. Hey, Garrus, remember that proximity mine ability that I always shit on? Well, we actually know enemies are going to be coming through this area. Come. We still don't have a lot of room, so we hold the line here. Use the combat drone to buy us a moment or two, Tally. Yeah, things are gonna get real ugly real fast. We need to keep them to frag away. At least there's not too many ranged enemies. Grenade is pretty powerful, all things considered. I don't know, try energy drain. That probably doesn't do anything. Uh oh. Marauder over there. Yeah, suck a lift grenade like that, Holmes. I hope that hurt a lot. He's doing something, and I don't like it. Uh, Tally doesn't have many direct attack. Drain his barrier. Oh, fuck. Uh, I should have predicted that. At least. Okay, the Geth Pulse Rifle is pretty badass as far as it goes. Okay, who's gonna go? Um, let me think. Tally, go to it. Tally, I'm on it. Come on, Garrus. Fuck. And this is where I pay hard for my choice, everybody. I do remember this music being amazingly fucking awesome. Okay, we need to fall back immediately. And we're just gonna come through here and it's gonna be ugly. Oh! Got him. Okay, Brood is dead. He was the main problem, if we're honest. Also, that barrier generator is... Really fucking annoying. I thought that brute was gonna be a lot bigger problem than it was. I'm just not in a position to fucking hit that shield generator, like, at all. 
here. Chill out. nervous wow if it turns out that this mission actually kills someone off for real life first of all I really doubt that second of all James will see his first mission in a while everybody does that sound callous it sort of is is there anything around here that we can make use of this facility is not that big. We could go look at what's wrong. I think I'd rather finalize the startup first, though. We might not find anything. Reactor fully powered and operational, Commander. Extraction point is dead ahead, Garrus. All right, I've got another contact on my radar. It's friendly. Hey, guys. My team is in your debt. No problem. <sighs> that was some good work, Tally. Because Tally's active powers weren't necessarily that well equipped to fighting Reaper troops, whereas Garrus. Job well done. He's got overload. Report back to the shuttles. He's got impact shot. Good work down there, Shepard. Without that depot, the entire theater would be at risk. What are the odds the Reapers will be back? I'm allocating a task force to maintain and defend the facility. If the Reapers come back, we'll be ready. Good. I read Captain Raleigh's report. It says she and her team wouldn't have made it without you. I'm glad I could help. I'll keep you posted on new developments. I've sacrificed enough out. people. I have a feeling I'm going to sacrifice more, but I'd rather not if I have uh, any options in this fight. A lot of funding. Okay, war assets. Crucible. Advanced starship fuel. 75. Whew. Nice. Not to mention we got another bit of uh, side quest fodder. Geth pulse rifle. I think I like it. Dr. Julie's research station in the Cillian Nebula. Huh. Awesome. Aw, uh, that team doesn't appear as a war asset? Oh well. Chances of success are still even. I reconnected because I knew the game would just bitch at me if I didn't do that. That was a relatively simple mission, all things considered. We didn't see any new types of enemies. Guys. Ladies. Individuals. Commander. There we go. I was getting a little freaked out. Okay, first of all, it's time to hit up the armory. I'm liking the new you, Esteban. It's about time you loosened up a little. <sighs> not sure how drinking mezcal late into the night makes me a better crewman. How does it not? It gives you heart. You need heart to fight this kind of war. A heartburn, maybe. Seriously, could we at least get some decent tequila? Hey, you're the procurement specialist. Set us up. <laughs> Fair point. First of all, let's check the Spectre Terminal. The game's just freaking out a little. Hmm. Also, I promised I would look into armor, which we can do here. Oh, game, what are you doing? It's, it's like stuttering. NASA fabrication, chest plate, Saris Council, Rosenkopf materials, pretty cool too. So, shield regeneration or power recharge or weapon damage. And they all look really cool as well. 
Um, any of those are nice things to have, honestly. I remember I was using the Saris Council chest plate last time. I think I'm going to go with... Now, Shepard's just looking more and more like a Spartan with this outfit. I'm gonna go with weapon damage, and then there's more headshot damage. Hmm. Interesting direction I've taken us in. I think I'll go with power recharge, actually, on this one. No helmet. So many different helmet available. That one? I just don't know, guys. Health boost and shield boost. There's the visor, there's that, there's this. God, most headgear in, like, any game. I just, I got no use for it whatsoever. Even though, I kind of like that it affects your stats that, uh, Shepard's refusing to wear a helmet. And there's lights on the front of this one. Make them white or black. Well, obviously white stands out better, so I'll do it. Hmm. I could do this instead, or orange, or pink. I'll stick with white. Okay, ADD time is over. Now, weapon upgrades. Geth Pulse Rifle. If I'm gonna be using a weapon, well... I've sure got the credits to keep everything upgraded. I could be putting this money towards another Spectre weapon, but honestly... Eh. And if Tally's going to be using the Claymore, then I'll probably want to... upgrade that as well. It's a hell of a shotgun. The only thing that AI squad mates get out of it is uh, weapon damage, but hey. More damage on a freaking Claymore? I'll go for it. The game is really freaking out on me for some reason. Serta, no more Metagel. I'm hoping to get like a million Metagel capacity eventually. Enhanced scope. Is that worth paying for? I don't really think it is yet. Smart choke. Accuracy by 45%. That's badass. You can get the first five levels of upgrades um, through the shops and stuff eventually. The last five are, uh, I believe... You, uh... Lion's requisition, is it? Oh. I believe you uh, need to get an import character, like re-import like a Mass Effect 3 character who finished the game back into Mass Effect 3 for a second playthrough. I'll buy these. Interesting design for a Geth fighter. It looks really insectoid. Shotgun Shredder mod wouldn't be bad either. And all the exports. Okay, shopping done. Yes, I'm really that lazy even though I'm probably going to the Citadel anyway. Massive waste of money. Although we're doing well on money, so I don't know. Let's go see if anybody's got something to say on the engineering deck. Javik's become a little more talkative lately. How do you see with only two eyes? Evolution has taken a strange turn in this cycle. It always does. Your Joker pilot insists I call myself Prothe the Prothean. I insisted he allow me to throw him out the airlock. <laughs> yeah, Joker will do that to you. Commander. I thought Joker, like, ribs everybody when we're not looking. And sometimes when we are. Yeah, I figured Tally would be set up down in engineering, but... Really? Kelly Chambers is dead? Yeah. No, what happened? Cerberus found her during a Citadel coup. Showed her where she stood. Oh, that's terrible. She seemed really nice. What if we'd gone back to Cerberus? Your gut saved us, Gabby. Yeah. I'm really sorry to hear that, guys. Commander? Power grid is in the green. If I'd have told Kelly to save herself, she could have. But I didn't know. Oh, Cargo Bay. 
Uh, you know, this really clears up the dilemma at the end of Mass Effect 2, whether you should give the base to the Elusive Man or not. Are you doing a story on the Asari, who were turned into Reaper creatures? The Ardot Yakshi? No. I think that story would be perfect for you. The hidden dark side of the most beautiful race in the galaxy. We have a huge Asari audience. If I do that story, I could lose them. That seems a bit like pandering. Ever seen how fast an e-democracy can abandon its allies? No. If I do my job, you won't. Huh. Second Star Broadcasting is headhunting me. I liked their Garvuk story, but seriously, I'm on the Normandy. Huh. Do we need to talk, Commander? Carry on, Vesley. Not right now, Allers. Let me know when we do. I want you dead. I want your family fucking dead. Whatever. Back to CIC then, I suppose. Although, you should check your map, and if the crewmates aren't in their usual position... Oh, I forgot to talk to Legion. Frack. I didn't even know he was here. He's a quiet guy when he wants to be. Mess hall. Adams and Shakwa are grabbing something to eat. Haven't talked to Ashley in a while either. So let's go do those. <laughs>